Hi everyone, I'm pleased to present this year's State of the Service report. Given recent events, this edition is necessarily different to previous years. Typically, the report will be shaped around the APS employee census results, but due to the COVID-19 pandemic, these results will not be available until early next year. So, instead, what we have is an exploration of how this year's events have changed the APS at pace. Responding to these crises, we've seen the APS operate as one enterprise, with commitment to service evident down to each individual. This year's report shares valuable insights from individuals and agencies who have innovated and adapted in these uncertain times to support the people of Australia and the government. It also highlights areas in which we can improve and lessons to be learnt to prepare us for the future. The APS has much to be proud of for its efforts in the last 12 months, but there's still much to do as Australia shifts from a crisis to a recovery footing. The data available paints a picture of an APS workforce that is collaborative, committed to service, and one delivering for the Australian people and the government. I want to thank you for reading this and thank you for all you've done over the past 12 months.